coach Beth's first year ended with a trip to Bowling Green and the Elite Eight. Despite losing six seniors off that squad, the expectations for this season remain high. It's going to be new. Losing six seniors, you know, takes a lot away from us, but we've worked really hard, and I think we're going to be a, an up-and-down team, going to be exciting. Uh, the guards have done great. Cass is getting in, in, in shape to be able to run with our guards, and I think it's going to be a, a very exciting, up-and-down, fast-paced basketball team. As Coach said, the Lady Eagles lost six seniors, including two players who scored more than 1,000 points in their careers, and a point guard who steadied the team. Several of the girls are looking to step up and fill those voids. We lost a lot of our offense, a lot of our rebounding, um, a lot of our leadership. So it's, it's going to be a situation where we got a lot of new faces and we're going to have to have people step up, but they're doing that right now. So our, our identity will unfold as the season goes forward. Um, we're hoping that the other four seniors will just step up and take right in their place. And then uh, we'll have a couple sophomores, Lindy and Danielle, to step up and do some work too. Senior Cassidy Shepard stepped up at the end of last season and earned a spot on the regional tournament team. She's expected to be a paint presence on a team with a loaded backcourt. We can actually play five guards at once this year, which is something a little bit unique that we hadn't had before. Lindy and Danielle, I mean, they'll step up a lot. Bailey will knock down some threes. Um, eighth grader Rachel, she's going to do a lot of work for us. And then uh, Madeline Bird and Shelby Turner can come in and uh, put a lot of pressure on people. The expectations remain high as the Lady Eagles look to bring home a fifth straight district title and a repeat regional championship. I don't think there's more pressure. We, we want to win every year, so it's the expectation's exactly the same as it was last year. Um, a little more pleasant this year, knowing that we won last year, but we're not satisfied with that. We want to we want to win every year, so the pressure doesn't go away. It's it's there all the time to be the best we can be. For GCTV, I'm Abby Forsythe.